Bill O'Reilly. My problem with O'Reilly was that he was a bully. I saw him just overwhelm, often women, with words and, uh, uh, I don't know, everything but say out loud that they're stupid because they have this. And I, I was really personally upset about that. And I, got a, I, I was invited on his show. <laughs> And you can see this, uh, it's on YouTube. It's titled, Phil Donahue Kicks O'Reilly's Ass. Uh, <laughs> now on the issue of, of uh, sexual harassment, I, I wasn't there and I don't wanna be a vulture. Um, I am fascinated by how the culture of a, an office or a, a TV station or whatever it may be, can often promote this kind of behavior. That really surprised me. Um, it, it, you know, I, the problem with speaking to it is you can sound very self-righteous, and I don't want to do that. Uh, he has paid a, he's paid a terrible price. I mean, it's hard to imagine a bigger fall than this man. But no sad songs or telethons for Bill O'Reilly. How much did he get for 25 million? Well, that'll get him into a, at least till Christmas, won't it? <laughs> and so, you know, he's just fabulously wealthy now with his books, The Killing Of, The Killing Of. Uh, he did personal appearances and his show brought in millions in advertising revenue. So I suspect he will pop up on some other, we call them platforms now, it's another word that came to me recently. Uh, you know, when we started we had three networks and that was that. And then comes, you know, the new media with all kind, you know, you, the news is in your hand now. Uh, but this is a, this, you know, this is another issue. Without the women's movement, O'Reilly never would have sustained this kind of tremendous punishment from his own company. The women's movement made that happen. And I think men are beginning to realize that now. Women are t going to be treated. I think there's evidence that they already are more respectfully in the business workplace than they have ever been before because men are looking up to see, oh my God, O'Reilly's gone. I don't want to be next. So all this is good. It's good for women, it's good for our kids, it's good for all of us. I think our young boys coming up are gonna be a lot more respectful of girls, girlfriends, dates uh, in, in social situations than uh, their younger counterparts ever thought of being, certainly in my world. 